motorcycle. Little bike up there on the hill. Oh yeah, that looks like a. I don't know. Might be a Honda Shadow. Could be. Oh yeah. Smell like back roads. Back roads or cows. I don't know. Yeah. Yes, sir. Oh, the green, green grass of green pastures. As Willie Nelson would say, and it's good to smoke the green, green grass. Mm -hmm. Mike, what was the joke about the Mountain Dew and the green leaves or something in the diet? That's right. My mother always stuck to her diet, which was always something green and leafy, a Mountain Dew and a cigarette. <laughs> That's crazy, Mike. Whoa. Maybe it looks like we're making a big circle out here. Okay. Yeah, looks like it. Yeah, but I think they got to cut back and head home. Yeah, I know. Uh, she said they got to get their son to soccer practice. Yeah. I think that was the Duck River, I believe. I don't know, my GPS is unverified. I didn't see the sign. Oh man, I love these roads. Yes, sir. Yes. And Makes I'm going to wanna get down on it. Get, get down, down on it. Down, down, down. Get down on it. Get down on it. Oh yeah. I'll tell you what. I'm gonna go back and retrace my steps with my route tracker. Exactly. Ooh, got a little wind coming on. Got a little crosswind. You know, we've had our share of dealing with crosswind. Yeah, we've had enough of that for the year. Yeah, time for the crosswinds to go home. Mm-hmm. Little lot. Little lot. Incorporated. Share of Barney Fight. <laughs> Little Lot General Store, your one-stop shop. Little Hood? No, okay, Little Lot Church. Yeah, man. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Yeah, buddy. GPS keeps telling me, giving me a direction where to go, but all I did was type in Centerville, Tennessee. I don't know if it's trying to take me to the Natchez Trace or what. Yeah, mine just said driving on Highway 230. Yeah. Oh, we got a twisty coming up. Twisty ahead. Prepare. Position flight. Lean. Yes, sir. Oh, mama slapped my eyes. Oh, yeah. Oh. Oh, yeah. Adam's a good rider, man. Yes, sir. He rolling. With a, oh. That's what I'm saying. With a passenger riding like that on the go wing. Oh, yeah. He's not a newbie. We are separating the men from the boys. With the crowbar. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Steven is back there in the dust. He needs to catch up. Yeah, I see him back there. Hang tight, Steven. Hang tight. Hang tight, Steven. Hey, you know what? I'm pretty much about guy with this uh mini max juice pack uh-huh pretty much just keep this thing on the scene though yeah I, I'm, I'm plugged into my battery yeah back up i'm gonna try chris caliente style and just let the camera run just let it run mike let it run till i run out of gigs till you run out of gigs you know i was talking about that uh 
I was commenting on one of Super Beat's videos. Uh-huh. And here's the issue I've been having with lately. Even a couple other people asked me, is it kind of like, where, where are your vids at, Mike? Where are your vids at? I was watching Super Beat's video. He's actually got a little book that he kind of lays out and organizes when he wants to release a video. And really? Kind of lays out the content and all that of what he wants to talk about. And as I responded, I, I got to do it off the cuff, man. Yeah. Because I get so overwhelmed with too much footage that I get frustrated and then I end up not making a video at all. Yeah. And it's a lot of it's a lot of work goes into vlogging, man. Yeah, that's a lot of. Ooh, that's what whoa. I'm talking about. Little sweet. Yeah, I nice. mean, it's a uh, truck, truck. You know, truck. I'll come back and end up having a hundred some clips, and I get so overwhelmed, I can't put none of them together to make one video. <laughs> you know, I'm the same way, Mike. I mean, I'll put a video together, but I do mine off the cuff. I don't, I don't script yeah. it. I don't rehearse it. Right. You know, I don't prepare it. I just get out there. Now, I may think of a of, of a subject in my head. Yeah. And I may, you know, do a right. video off a subject that I'm thinking about, but I don't. Yeah. You know, it's not rehearsed. It's not script. It's all impromptu. Well, that's kind of how mine are. In other words, like if I if I leave for work in the morning time, and I want to do a vlog, I, I'll think a topic or something or maybe you know talk about what i did or where i've ridden to or a place i went to eat or something like that but right man i've tried to put them together and put a story together after a long ride and man i guess i, I got so much footage that I, I can't even think straight you know yeah it's almost like walking into a hoarder's house, <laughs> you know? There's just so much crap there, you can't figure out what to do with any of them. Yeah. You know, and it's, uh, I don't know, I get bogged down sometimes like that. So. Yeah, well, what you could do is uh, just go back and look through your videos, uh -huh. and let's just say some special moments in the video uh, that you, you know, you like, yeah. that you highlighted, maybe five minutes of it. Right. Then go out, do a vlog, and talk about that particular right. part of the video yeah. that you was really liking. That's true. You know, so just go, just go through, you know, download it, record it. Right. I mean, download it, and then just go through it, look at it. Yep. And you may have like, you know, four or five minutes of something in there you really like. Yeah. And just get on your motorcycle and go do a vlog. Right. On that clip that you really like. I got and, you. And talk yeah. about that. Yeah. That way your that way your footage is never is it's you know it's never it never goes to waste. Right, exactly. You know. You know, for example, if I want to talk about wingding, I can go back and pull my footage up. Right. And incorporate that footage into the current video. Right, right. It's a lot of work goes into doing videos, so yeah. and the then, moral of this vlog is stopping. If you decide to vlog Get ready for some time intensive. Yeah. Time intensive time spent. Yeah. Trying to put this stuff together. It's the same way with me, Mike. You know, people they enjoy my videos. They ask me to make videos. They watch my vids. But it's a lot of work going to making videos, man. Oh, it's man. not. Yeah, hey, you ain't kidding. You know, it's a lot of work goes into that. You know. Yeah. Yeah. Well. Must have been Steven Stereo I heard back there. Yeah. Must be pimping back there. Pimping, you know, his exact words to me was something like, pimping ain't easy, but somebody's got to do it. Oh, that's right. Pass it to Sons of Anarchy. <laughs> All right. I tell you what, the first gas station we get by, I think we're going to need to, we need to, we need to hit it. Yeah, I didn't think about that. I'm not sure how far away out. I hate to have to stop too soon, man. We just got started rolling. Good. That's true. But if we don't, don't stop for fuel, if we don't stop for fuel, we'll be we will be stopping. 
yeah, whether you want to or not. Yeah. That is true. Yeah, man, I tell you, yesterday, man, I got down and detailed the fire out of this bike yesterday. Yeah, I could tell by the pictures you sent me. And it was looking good, too. You polished it. Oh, yeah. Waxed it or something. Yeah, like I was saying to you, I don't, I don't wax it too often. Maybe once, twice a year. Well, I waxed mine yesterday, Mike. Yeah, I did, too. Mm-hmm. The bugs stand no chance <laughs> the, staying on my bike. The bugs slide right off. Bug will be trying to come down the freeway and say, that's Memphis Mike's bike, stay away. <laughs> yep, that's true. There is the law. Yeah. The law dogs. Ooh. Crosswinds. I'll be curious to see if this, uh, Windscreen helps out any. Yeah, it sounds good to me. On the audio. Uh huh. Sounds real good to me. Man, what a great Saturday, though. I know. And Man. and tomorrow's supposed to be even better. Joe sure is. Tell you what, he knows his way around. Oh yeah. Cause I can't tell you if we heading east, west, north, or south. No, me either. Me either. Man. Tell you what, I'm beginning to wonder this face shield I've got on this helmet, just how much UV ray it cuts out. I've been in my full face helmet all day and I was looking in the bathroom mirror face still look a little red. You mean your yeah. face or your shield? My what? Your face or your shield looks red? Yeah, my face. Oh. My face. Yeah, from like the sun. Oh, okay. I'm beginning to wonder about this, uh, this helmet shield. Like I say, how much UV it cuts out. I'm beginning to think not much. I'd really like to get me a second shield, you know, a dark shield for the daytime, but I get tired of carrying stuff around, man, have to swap it out. Yeah. I'll have to buy me a trailer just to carry my accessories. <laughs> the old trailer. Right. I think a, I think a uh, trailer would look good behind your bike, Mike. Oh, yeah. Ain't no doubt about it. Maybe a matched paint Unico. Man, oh yeah. I don't think you and uh, Lou Ann wouldn't go home. No, I know it. You store all your stuff in the in the trailer. And I feel that thing full of ice. Mm-hmm. What's gonna be a 48 pack of Coronas? And find me the Mexican word for the devil. The Mexican word of the day. Yeah, we need to do Mexican word of the day. The Mexican word of the day would be Mexican judo. <laughs> what, what do you mean? <laughs> that means you don't know if I got a gun. You don't know if I got a knife. <laughs> you don't know. <laughs> Let's see you if we need can... to tell him to stop and get gas up here? Yeah, we need to. You better let him know. Yeah, let's see if we can. That's sad. I can't get that. Yeah, we'll be Yeah, we'll see. we got him. Okay, yeah, hold on. I signaled to her. Let's ask him. We're about a quarter, about a quarter of a tank. Is there more gas up this way? Should we, or should we just get it right here? All right. We're going to get some gas. 
Yeah, yeah. Yeah. I'm at about a quarter of a tank. So, here. All right. You going here, Mike? Yeah. Okay. Let's see. Be careful on the turnaround. Cars are coming. Got a white car coming. You see that Jerry Palladino? Ride like a pro with Memphis Mike. Oh, this is where we came in at, man, originally. I'm going to turn around and give me a pair. Do me a Jerry Palladino ride like a pro. What I'm talking about. Here's Memphis Mike on the go wing. Steven looking good on the gold wing. Looks like we made a big circle. Yeah. And there's Adam Nunn on yeah. the gold wing. So, man, we've just been hanging out, having a good time. All right. We'll just stop and get a little. Go across the interstate. A little petrol. And, and then we can on probably there. ride the wing thing. That heart yeah. Blow. Turn them on. I know. I turned my That's hard coat. I just turned on the that kind of filled in the back, you know. Whoa. For the small yeah, the lower small of the back. Good. Cost Yeah, I normally keep those off. Cost up. more than my couch does. Ooh. But it was yeah, I, I love them. They only about forty bucks on eBay. Mm -hmm. And I was thinking about putting I got two more at the house. I yeah. thought about putting them on the side, but that may be an overkill. Like a switch, you where it pushes it out. No, they don't drag at all. Yeah. No, they don't drag at all because if it was going to drag, it would hit the bottom of the bike. Uh -huh. Yeah, if it was going to drag, so it, it doesn't drag at all. Ours is, yeah, our Ford Expedition. You know these roads pretty well, huh? I spend all the time on the back of the Man. Good too. Man, he got it all chromed up. Look at that. Got the. Look at that. Yeah, he got it looking good too. And this is a 20. You there, Mike? Mm, yeah. Oh, okay. This is 2013, I think he said. Yeah. Yeah. I like it. I mean, he got a subwoofer or something in this thing to make it sound that good. Gotta have a subwoofer going on there. Yeah. Make me want to dance a little bit, man. Yeah, now these are going to be the next thing I get, Mike. Yeah. I promise you that. You can believe that. That's coming. Yeah. And Mike might look good, too. I am feeling this music, man. Yeah. Woo. Woo. Yeah, that bike look good. And he's got the, the 40th anniversary, the 2015 40th anniversary. Faith, it was nice meeting you. Okay. Thank you. Huh? Oh, thanks for inviting us out. There's some nice roads out here. We're going to have to come back. Yeah. I like those wind deflectors. I need to get those on my bike. Yeah. Turn them in. They really? Pull air in, yeah. 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 All right, y'all ready to saddle up? Go wing. Good yeah. to see you again. Yep, absolutely. Yeah. Steven got a car tire on that thing. <laughs> How does that car tire handle? No, right. It does? All righty. Well, let's fire up. Get used to it now. Today's vlog is brought to you by Lipton Green Tea Citrus. <laughs> Okay. And we'll just keep on going. Okay. All right. Cool. All righty. So, Mike, they're not riding back with us? Yeah, we're following them part of the way. Okay. Yeah, and then he's going to break off. Okay. It's because it's 3.30. Okay. And if we hit I-40, that'll put us back in the Memphis area about 6.30, 7.00. There's Memphis Mike and Mrs. Memphis Mike. Emerging. Emerging from the darkness. 